has Nat Bass got a hair in B at the moment? Yes. Or a girl crush? Ooh, oh, oh my gosh, okay, total girl crush and hair in B would yep. have to go to Gigi Hadid. She's lying, and isn't she's she? she's just a babe. I like everything that she does, head to toe, I, I adore. I love what she's done with her hair. I love when it's a bit darker, but then I love it when it's really blonde. That yeah. girl can do no wrong. Now, as being such a busy person, yeah. do you have any hints for busy people out there for hair and makeup, your quick go-to that I can just pull out in five seconds sort of vibe? Oh, okay. So, I mean, I definitely usually just chuck my hair up in a big knot if it's really dirty and whatever. Yeah. But one tip that my sister taught me was when you wash your hair, part it wherever you want to part it and brush it down into the shape. So say I part it yeah. in the middle and then I leave it and then it dries not frizzy. I yeah. don't know how that works. Like, do you even know this? It's just kind With of a like... a brush, not a comb? Yeah, so yep. I brush it and it stays in place and then once it kind of dries, it's not like... If I left it, it would be like this massive hair. But I love that tip. It's, well, it's, it's kind awesome. of like almost like a set. So you're combing yeah, it into sort of place and let it dry it naturally. And it just dries. Yeah. So I'm like, yeah. this is the bomb. Who yeah. did I, why didn't I know this? Um, yeah, it's awesome. What about you? Like, how, did, how do you... Do I do this at home? Like, yeah. if I want to... So I've given you texture today. So yeah. my, I, what I like to do... I mean, you've got great hair. You've got a wave. And so not what I do... Not a perm. <laughs> but maybe. Who knows? <laughs> so you've got a wave. So I just kind of just looked at... I wanted to keep some of your natural movement. So yeah. I feel like if you blow it all out with a blow dry, it kind of creates more of a... You know, more of a st over style, a stylized look. Yeah. So I wanted to keep it kind of raw and cool and... Yeah. Chic. So I just used a small tong and I wrapped... So I blow, blow dry your end to smooth the cuticle out okay. and then um, just, just pop it in the part and then with a sort of small curling wand I bent, uh, the uh, small pieces of the hair I bent around the wand but without clamping it ah. and so then pulled it out a bit. So you got a bit of a bend. What happens if you clamp it compared to Clamp it's clamp. a stronger curl. So if you're more oh. of a glamorous, tighter curl you put, okay. you clamp it. So I just bent it around. There's some great wands out there at the moment that don't have clamps. Okay. So you can just bend it around and create yeah. more shapes with. And then I just use some Orbe texturizing, um, Orbe ah. um, spray. What's I'll put called? that in my comments below, I'll put the links yeah. in my bio. Yeah. Um, and um, yeah, it's a bit of Elnet hairspray, which is always good. That's probably my number one. Oh my one. gosh, it's like That's an my old top fave, five. Babe. Love Elnet. Love, love. It's a, yeah, workable hairspray that you can pop in yeah. and just pop in. And also, my trick for girls, which I yeah. think is everything, once you've styled it or if you just want a quick freshen up, yeah. Flip your head upside down. Really? The That's what we did. Down. We did the flip. Always got to do I the flip. I never do the flip at home, but I'm going to do the flip from now on. Shake it out. Back. Boom. Shake it out, pop it back, and then uh -huh. place it. And it just puts some air in it and shake it. You know, oh, I love air in the hair. it up in a good way. Air in the air hair. Air in the hair, girl. Ooh.